And first at 11, dozens of golden retrievers rescued from what police call deplorable conditions at a home in Hopkinton. And now the owner is telling NBC10 that's not true. Thank you for joining us this Friday night. I'm Patrice Wood. The night team's Temi Topa Adelaide joins us live in studio with both sides. Temi? Patrice, the owner didn't want to go on camera, but says there's another side to the story. He says the seizing of his 27 golden retrievers shocked him, and his customers can vouch for him that his animals were healthy and safe. 27 golden retrievers seized this afternoon from this home on Alton Bradford Road in Hawkinton. I was very upset when I heard. You know, it's, it's most impressive. But, you know, I mean, he doesn't run a puppy farm. Hopkinton police say someone bought a puppy at the home complained about the condition of the property, prompting the police to stop by. They allegedly found several adult dogs penned up outside in these kennels and an overwhelming odor from the home. The main issue here is to get the dogs removed from the home and get them placed in the shelter for care. Inside, they found these 20 puppies inside this large pen, all of which are now at the Rhode Island SPCA in Warwick, receiving health checks. Hours later, off camera, the owner showed me these two papers he says he got from the North Stonington Veterinary Clinic, one on February 26, stating nine puppies were in good health and received their initial vaccination. On March 1st, negative test results for their fecal exam. He says the animals were well-fed and in good health and the kennels for the larger dogs maintained. He said the home did smell like urine, but it was because there were 20 puppies inside. Cal Farley bought three dogs from the owner, these two, Rudy the Third and Della, and one for a family member. Farley says the owner did nothing wrong. All those dogs in there, you're going to get an odor, and, and what are you going to do with them? You know, he kept them inside because it was cold. You know, you, know, you know, is that any better than someone that puts them outside in a kennel in the cold? That's ridiculous. The owner said during the seizing of the dogs, he was told that a breeder's license is mandatory for at least 19 puppies. He had 20 puppies and no license. He says he couldn't control how many puppies his dogs had, but he is cooperating with the investigation. No charges have been filed yet, but the chief said investigators will be reviewing the case. Police say the owner's home was condemned until it can be cleaned up. As for those beautiful golden retrievers, the Rhode Island SPCA says they are not currently available for adoption, but that could change. Live in studio, Temi Talk Badalea, NBC 10 News 19.